everybody, I'm Doc Mengai. I'm a licensed medical doctor. Today, I'm going to share with you the live stream feature of the Stemoscope application. If you haven't watched my first video about Stemoscope, you can go to the description box below and click the link. This amazing live stream feature of the Stemoscope application will enable the doctor to call his patient and vice versa. This feature will also make it possible for the doctor to auscultate his patients real time. This uh, stemoscope application is available for download for both Android and iOS users. Um, just to have a review, on my left side you will see the Apple devices compatible with the stemoscope application. Stemoscope application is compatible with iPhone, iOS 8 or later, iPad Touch, iOS 8 or later, Mac, uh, Mac OS 11 or later, and a Mac with the Apple emoji. Okay, now I'm going to teach you step by step how to use the live stream of the Stemoscope application. Step 1. Register a live streaming account. Take note that no Stemoscope device is needed to register a live streaming account. Okay, to register a live streaming account, you have to click the live streaming icon located at the lower part of the Stemoscope application homepage. And then, you have to provide all the necessary details like your email, your name, and chosen password. Then click the register button. Step 2. Ask your patient or your friend to register a live streaming account as well so that you and your friend or patient can call each other. Step 3. Add your friend. If you're a doctor, add your patients. If you're the patient, add your doctors. All you have to do is go to the contact page and click the icon located at the right upper corner of the contact page. Then you will be asked to provide the email of your friend, doctor, or patient that he used when he registered a live streaming account. Easy peasy. By the way, don't forget to click the send request button. But in my case, my patients and I and Dudu are the ones who added me to their contact list. When they added me to their contact list, I receive an email of request. When you receive an email like this, just click the link of confirmation so they can finally be added to your contact list. So there, in my contact list, you can already see the name of Endai and Dudung. Okay, step number four. You can finally call your patient or your friend or your doctor. But to make your call successful, your patient or friend must open the Stemoscope app, click the live stream icon to enter the contact page. The patient must be on the contact page for him to receive your call. Once you're already on the contact page, click your patient's name. Now the network may not be good sometimes. If your call fails, try again. Okay, let's try to call and die and do do. Now, if you're an Apple user like me, you have to connect your earphone or headphones, whether they be wired or not, to your devices prior to making the call. This will make the call successful. Okay, let's call and die and do do. Hello and die, kamusta na kayo? Bakit ka pala nagpa-appointment? May nangyari ba sa asawa mo na si Dudong? Naku, Dok, buti na lang pumayag ka agad sa appointment na nirequest ko. Kasi si Dudong kagabi habang natutulog, gumagawin mo yung kamay niya sa dibdib niya. Hindi ko alam kung sa panaginip niya nagtitiktok lang siya. Kasi nung mga nakaraang araw, na-addict si Dudong sa tiktok. O kaya, naisip ko, baka sumasakit ang dibdib niya. Dok, nag-aalala po talaga ako. Kasi hindi masyado nagsasabi si Dudong kapag may nararamdaman. Pang-apat na asawa ko na si Dudong ko. Ayoko na mabyuda ulit. Tatong asawa ko na yung nilibing ko. 
sabi ng mga kaibigan ko, kaya daw maaga na mamatay ang mga asawa ko. Kasi lagi ko daw pinapakain ng bulalo. Pakudok, di mo na itatanong eh. Specialty ko yun. Napakasarap ko ng buto ng bulalo. Kaya nga ako pinapakasala ng mga asawa ko eh. Dahil sa aking bulalo. Ay! Gusto mo, Dok? Patikim ko sa'yo? Padalan kita dyan! Padeliver ko! Kakaluto ko lang kanina, Dok! Ay, salamat na lang. Pass na lang. Teka, sabi ko sa inyo, umuiwas na kayo sa pagkain ng karne para di kayo makakasakit ni Dudong. Sa susunod ha, mas maraming prutas at gulay ang kainin ninyo. O sige, tawagin mo na si Dudong para ma-check up ko na. O sige, Dok. Tawagin ko na si Dudong. Mahiyain talaga to si Dudong. Magandang araw, Dudong. And I, pakiilis na yung t-shirt niya para ma-examine natin ang dibdib niya. Pakikuha na din yung stemoscope mo. Okay, ilagay mo na yung stemoscope sa dibdib ni Dudong. Gusto na po tunog ng dibdib ng tudong ko? Hindi, normal naman ang tunog Ay, ng dibdib ni Dudo. Walang ano man. Bye-bye, Enday. Bye-bye, Dudong. Okay, to my fellow doctors, patients, friends, I hope you will have an opportunity to try the live stream feature of the Stemscope application. I honestly think this live stream feature of the Stemscope app will make online consultation much easier. If you still don't have your own stemoscope, you can go to the description box below and click the link Stemoscope Philippines. I would like to thank Stemoscope Philippines for helping me to make this vlog possible. If you like this video, don't forget to click the like button and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Bye-bye!